Alrighty, I'm going to try to do the quickest tutorial of my life. I want to show you how you can add in your brand colors into your Canva brand kit, or if you don't have a brand kit, finding the hex codes, so the color codes of your colors, potentially a designer or a web developer, or somebody has asked you for these codes, or you're wanting to add these into your Canva brand kit, but you don't know how to get them there. This is super simple, super, super, super simple. <laughs> and I can't wait to show you how. Hi, if we haven't met, my name is Jackie. I'm a graphic designer who specializes in teaching business owners how to do their own graphics. And yes, I talk quickly. You don't need to tell me in the comments. <laughs> I appreciate you all. Um, okay, let's get into this. So pretty much all you need to do is open up a design where you've got your colors in. For me, I've opened up my mini star guide. This is a free resource I give people that do my free challenge. Link in the comments or the description if you would like to do that. All you need to do is click on the color that you want, select it up here, and press this little toggle button here. You'll see a little filter button comes up as well as a little hex code underneath. The hex code is a letter and number combination that makes your color up. And this is what's great for using for web colors. So anything you see on your computer, anything you're using on Canva, for example, is great to use this hex code. But if you don't want to just try to type this out, if you actually click on this, you'll see that you, this here, you can change the color. You can add in your gradient if you want to. But what we really want to see here is the hex code. And that's this figure down here. So you can just collect this copy it and paste it anywhere that you need to. You can also type in a new hex code. So if someone's given you a hex code or you found a hex code somewhere that you love, you can also enter that in here. And it will like say, if I just change this number, it's just changed the color altogether for me. Um, and you can just edit it and add in your colors there. So all you need to do is copy this hex code. So I'm just gonna press control C or you can right click and press copy. Then go over to Canva and you wanna head over to the brand kit section. So for me, I've got Canva Pro, so I have access to the brand kit. If you don't already have this, you'll have to get Canva Pro to use this feature. There's a link to upgrade inside the description as well. Now I've already got a lot of brands here. I'm just going to press add new to keep it simple for you. I'm going to say new brand in here. You would type in your business's name and then you can add in your colors. So you can see here there's spaces for logos, fonts, all those things. Today we're going to focus on colors. I'm going to press add new here. I'm going to select what's there, press paste and paste in the code that I've just copied from earlier. And you'll see that exact perfect color is coming up there. That's all it takes. So all I'm going to do is toggle back to my other design, click on the next color, go through the exact same process, copy this figure, go back into here, press add new, paste in the color. And you just have to do that over and over again with all of your colors. Hopefully you don't have 50 colors because that would be probably too many colors for your color palette. But I do recommend five, six, three if you're really going basic, but it's even good to have a few different color variations. So for me in my real color palette, I actually have a darker and a lighter and a middle shade of purple. Same with my blues and a few different shades of my other colors too, to make it really versatile to work around. You'll see I've got this lighter blue here. Copy this, go to my brand kit and paste that in. And so that's all that you need to do. Or for example, if you wanted to share this with someone, you could just add in a little text box here and paste in your hex code and pop that down here next to your color so that you can always remember what the color is and pass that on to someone else. So when you want to use these colors from your brand kit, all you need to do is go back to your Canva, click on the brand section here. And you can see for me, I've got all of mine sitting in here. I've got a few different brands as well. And so you can just click on this and honestly, it'll apply it to your design. Um, or what you want to do if you're trying to change a specific color, you can just click on a particular shape or element or design press the color up here and you can see that it's listed right here and you can toggle between them if you've got more, but it's listed right here, ready for me to click on the new colors and apply those perfectly to my design. So that's super easy and super accessible. So I hope you found that helpful. If you're looking for more design and branding tips, even some more intricate tutorials other than this one, feel free to watch the rest of my YouTube videos or you can learn from me for free at the Seriously in Business Challenge. It's a three part video, 20 minute bingeable lessons where you can learn all about branding, design, how to use Canva and actually really start to use design strategically in your business to grow your business. So thank you for joining me today and I'll see you soon for another tutorial. Bye.